Shalom. 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 We want to start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Basham Yahushai, Basham Raka Kodash. Double honors unto the apostles and the elders of the great millstone who rule well. Double honors. All right. Um, please, all, all blessings unto the brothers pushing the work through the four corners of the earth in truth and sincerity. All right. Shalom unto the, um, the speckled Buddhist lights, the scattered, who is scattered among the heathen and look like the heathen. All right. Shalom unto the few and faithful Aquatium, the sisters listening and learning, right? May the brothers from the GMS Prophetic Vibrations, right? Brother, brother, um, or your, your Roshalam. Brother Kayal. And brother, um, Karatiza. Brother Imad. Khan. Khan, Imad Bayan. Khan. You know, and we just coming at you with a, another, um, you continue in the spirit of the breakdowns. Alright? You know, so today we'll be going through Revelation, the first chapter. And hopefully, Lord willing, we'll be able to um, continue through the whole book of Revelation. All right, just to edify, you know, and um, you know, and, and and edify and build up, you know, the body for those who new come into the truth. And even ourselves. Yeah, of course, okay. edify yourself first, okay. you know, and especially now, you know, we had to be in the spirit of prophecy because all these prophecies come into pass, you know, as we speak. All right, everything coming to pass, so it's important to understand as we did the book <coughs> of Genesis. All right, the same thing in the book of, of Revelation, you know, there are a lot of dark speeches, all right, dark mm. saying parable parables. Metaphors right. and things. Yeah, all these metaphors, correct? It, it's not a, it's a, you have to be in a spiritual mindset to, it, to get the understanding of the book of Genesis, the book of Genesis and the um the book of Revelation. Revelation. Alright, so that we will start off one time in the scriptures. Let's start with Sirach 39. Verse 1. Sirach 39, which is Ecclesiasticus. Mm -hmm. And one, it say, But he that giveth his mind to the law mm -hmm. of meditation. But he that giveth his mind to the law of the Mosai mm -hmm. and is occupied in the meditation thereof mm -hmm. will seek out the wisdom of all the ancient right. and be occupied in prophecies. Right, occupied in prophecies, the book of Revelation. Alright. It is 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 prophetic. Alright? It's very prophetic. There is all the prophecies being mm -hmm. revealed. All right, that prophecy has been revealed. So this is why we have to meditate in these things. Why you have meditating in things? Because the prophecy, prophecy is impacting us today, right? Mm -hmm. As we speak, you know, prophecy, you know, you know, is the testimony of how I was the spirit of prophecy. All right, and that's how we're gonna know how to move, and and all that is going back into wisdom and understanding, which we know is really our treasure. Okay, mm -hmm. and um, you know, hey, continue reading up. Grand verse two. It says he will keep the sayings of the renowned. Men mm -hmm. and where the prophets, the men of the Lord, go ahead. And where subtle parables are, he will be there also. Can he will seek out the secrets of of grave sentences? Mm -hmm. Same and, thing we're talking about. All right, go ahead. Can and be con conversant in dark parables. Mm -hmm. Right. Go to verse eight. Yeah? You can go to verse eight. Oh, can. Mm -hmm. It's a he shall serve among great men right. and He's appear before princes. The great men are the prophets, the men right. of the Lord, right? Go ahead. He will travel through strange countries, mm -hmm. for he has tried the good and the evil among men. And how we travel through strange um, strange countries via the unicorn, right? Can. By the internet. This world going out, right? You know, I'm judging what we judging. What does what the scripture say? We can read that part over, Baba Kusha. Can. It says, for he has tried the good and the evil among men. Right, you know, and that's why we do these videos. Right, we use, use examples, videos, other secular videos, things that happen, and, and we, we filter through the scriptures. Well, okay. it says, He will give his heart to resort early to the Lord that mm. made him, mm. and, and will pray before the Most High, mm -hmm. and will open his mouth in prayer and make supplication for his sins. Can ask for your repentance, okay. and that is what we preach into. We preach of the uh, gospel of repentance, repent, you know, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Can okay. right, go ahead. Verse 6 it says, When the great Lord will, he shall be filled with the spirit of understanding. Mm, Holy Spirit, go ahead. Okay. He shall pour out wise sentences hmm. and give thanks unto the Lord in his prayer. And that is what we do every day. Give thanks unto Yahweh for his Holy Spirit. Okay. We understand that it is true. Go ahead. He shall direct his counsel and knowledge, and in his secrets he shall he meditate. Shall he meditate? And this is what we do. And we do. And you know, we meditate in these scriptures. We break down these scriptures, you know, and okay. building up the tabernacle like King David. Go ahead. It says, He shall show forth that which he had learned and shall glory in the law of the covenant of right. the mm -hmm. Lord. Right. So you see, we're showing forth what we learn. 
you know we don't you can't keep a candle cover up cover up right the scripture say to let your light shine right so this is what we're doing you know we can't keep the knowledge that we get from the elders and apostles because all what we learn here we learn it from the elders and the apostles of the great millstone right and you know so we, hey, we give thanks and praise to have a for them Good. all right so now let's jump into revelation one and one there's the book of Revelation, chapter 1 and verse 1. Can. You see, the revelation of Yahweh Shia Mashiach, mm -hmm. which power gave unto him mm -hmm. to show unto his servants things which must short, shortly come to pass. So it's prophecy. Can. Pro prophecy, mean to say before. Go ahead. And he sent and signified it by his angel unto his servant John. Right, because this is, this is John, the John the, the, the revelator, John the apostle, mm -hmm. all right, who was on the island of Patmos. Right, you know, he was condemned and, and sent to the island of Patmos. You know, I believe, you know, that because he um they tried to kill him many times and they fail. Alright? Mm -hmm. So they sent him to the island of Patmos as a as a punishment. It was a penile colony colony colony, right? A, a colony where they punish people, right? Mm -hmm. They condemn them. I believe it was the salt mines he was sent to work in. Alright? But the wood, the wood revelation, you know, when he break down the wood revelation, re goes into back. And veilation goes into veil, right? Um, so, so basically, you're pulling back the veil, right? Why are you pulling back the veil on? You know, you're pulling back the veil on, on your, basically your Hawashai, right? Because as we read before, the testimony of Yahweh is the spirit of prophecy. Yahweh Shai was the one who unsealed the book, right? Fung Woody, when we go into the book of Re Revelation later on, he was okay. Fung Woody to unseal the book, right? So, reveal the prophecies, okay. all right? So, the prophecies now come to us, you know, come to John, and he was written down here for our learning. All right, but that's the point, you know. So it's pulling back the veil, you know, really revealing what was hidden, all right, what was sealed up, right. And a lot, of, a lot of ways, the Lord used Esau, Edom, all right, as the enemy, you know, to seal it up, all right. Mm. So uh, let's go Isaiah twenty-five and seven. God, this is the book of Isaiah twenty-five and verse seven. God, and He will destroy in this mountain mm -hmm. the face of the covering cast and what mountain is that a mountain talks about our rulership who is who ruling, who ruling the earth right now job 9 and 24 Can. the earth is given mm -hmm. into the hands of the wicked Can. right so you both pulling back in this mountain go ahead Can. So, um, yeah. if i could just go mm -hmm. over that one and three too mm -hmm. right because i say they set their, their nests in the stars you know mm -hmm. saying, who shall bring them down mm -hmm. yeah i like going into the the mountains going into the, the rulership and what they like they like skyscrapers Mm. All these things, the satellites, when they look down, you know, all these things. So that they like the eagle. Can. The eagle is biggest nest where? On the mountain. The mountain High. Can, yeah. yeah. You know? Go ahead. Okay. Um, starting over the, the um, verse right there. Can. I no problem, Mark. Go ahead. Right. This is Isaiah 25 and verse 7. And he will destroy in this mountain the face of the covering cast mm. all over people. Mm. Um, over all people, yeah. Can. can. And the veil that is spread over all nations. Can and the veil that's spread over because a lot of a lot of lies, even in the scriptures, has been perpetuated, especially with Israel. Because that's what the Lord concerned with our people, right? We've been lied to and told that we were we were ne Negroes, we were Africans, we were Specs, we were Latinos, we were Native Americans, right? You know, we were lied. We were lied. A big part of what we was lying about was was uh, Yahweh Shai and even his image, right? Because you know, Yahweh Shai was a Hebrew Israelite. Mm. You know, he, he um, his name too. You know, his name too wasn't Jesus. Mm. All right, his name it, Jesus went to um, Jesus. Well, you know, J didn't exist until fifteen twenty four. All right, and then before that, they call him Jesus, which is a Greek translation. Mm. Right? But Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai, all right, is is a Hebrew. Is like the spoken Hebrew. All right, so we're gonna get that just now. Um, I could bring second Thessalonians two and three, but we'll shut. Second Thessalonians okay. 2 and 3 yeah, can. and it reads mm -hmm. Let no man deceive you mm. by any means mm. for that day shall not come except they come a falling away first Alright and we fell away during the time when we um, you know when we went into captivity you know slavery under this devil alright and when we fell away you know unlike the other captives we had before we, we didn't we, we lost our heritage we didn't know that we were the Israelites anymore. Go ahead, Ak. And that man of sin be revealed. That man of sin be revealed. That goes back to what? Revelation. Okay. Pulling back. Okay. Alright, and that's what's happening right now with this with this this word coming out. Alright. He being revealed. Alright. 
But the point is then, the Lord was a Hebrew Israelite. Mm -hmm. You could get Hebrews 7 and 14, Baba Kusha. <laughs> I know, I'm not bring that Lovely. <laughs> well, as he spread. I know, I like that. Bring that <laughs> yeah, you go ahead. Yeah. How much more you have in that? Let me see. Yeah, you go ahead. You go ahead. You go ahead. I read from the top again. Thessalonians. 2 1 3 Let no man deceive you mm -hmm. by any means, mm -hmm. for that day shall not come, except there come a fallen away first, mm -hmm. and that man of sin be revealed, mm -hmm. the son of perdition. The son of destruction. Mm -hmm. So he, he being revealed you know, by, by the scriptures. Mm -hmm. Alright? The, the veil being pulled back, the veil that he put over I'm us being pulled back. Alright? The image of the Lord, the, the Father, the, ho the holy angels. All of that being 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 debunked, you know, and uncovered. Okay, he being made naked. So, so you have Hebrews 7 and 14, you have that? Correct, is that what I'm saying? Let me just bring this precept just okay, you go ahead. Um, I mad you will ask 26 and 14, Baba Kusha. Can there's the book of Jeremiah 49 and 10. Mm -hmm. Right, they say, But I have made Esau bear, I have uncovered his secret places. Can. And he shall not be able to hide himself. Can he not going to be able to hide himself? You know, he being naked. The scripture talk about uncovered legs. You know, bare ties, all those things like that. That's roughly paraphrasing. So he, he, which was his his power anyway, his secrecy. Can. All right. No, no, no. Everything being exposed. So his power is being <coughs> taken down. Which is a sign, right? Yeah, Can. it's a sign that his kingdom is going down. Can. All right. Go ahead. Let's finish it off. Mm -hmm. He say his seed is spoiled, mm -hmm. and his brethren mm -hmm. and his. Neighbors, mm -hmm. and he is not. Yeah, he's not. He's gonna be nothing eventually. First, he's gonna go into captivity, right, for a thousand years, and afterwards, he's gonna be completely rooted out of the land they live in. Hmm. All right. Can. So I said that's all you have there. Yeah, can, can let's go to Hebrews can. seven and fourteen. Can. This is book of Hebrews seven and verse fourteen. Can. For it, for it, it is evident that our Yahweh hmm. sprung out of Judah hmm. of which tribe Moses speak nothing concerning priesthood can so can yeah yeah if, if it's um depending on how the, how the context, context is yeah, yeah. so yeah, that yeah so that would be Yahweh yeah that Lord Lord um in all caps is Yahweh and Lord capital L but lower lowercase the rest of the world L O R D is Yahweh Shai can that's all right so so um Yahweh Shai, right? Yahweh Shai, you know, he was a tribe of Judah, which are so-called black black people, right? Okay. In today's terms, right? He and he was a Hebrew Israelite. All right, he spoke in Hebrew, right? Now, how are we going to know that? We get Acts 26 and verse 14. This is when um, Paul was, the Lord struck down Paul in the desert. Yahweh Shai struck him down, you know, and and, and um, spoke to him. Oh, you have it? Yeah. Go ahead. I'm with it. Mm -hmm. Acts 26 and 14, mm -hmm. and it reads... And when, and when we were fall, we're all we fallen, were all fallen mm -hmm. to the earth, I heard a voice speaking unto me, mm -hmm. say, and saying, in in the Hebrew tongue, Can. Sol, Sol. Sol, Sol, why, why pre persecute us? Why persecute us? Mm -hmm. Thou me. Hmm. Right, it, go ahead. Is, it is hard for thee to kick against the pricks. Can, but the point <laughs> is, he, he spoke in what tongue? The Hebrew, Hebrew tongue. tongue. And it was Yahweh Shai. You see, yeah. you see the red writing? Can. It was Yahweh Shai. So Yahweh Shai. And he's saying mm -hmm. in, the, mm -hmm. in the Hebrew tongue. Right. Mm -hmm. you know, in the so Hebrew he tongue. Speak in the, in Correct. The yeah, go ahead. You yeah. Well, so, so, you see? So, yeah. So, so, why persecute us? Why persecute thou me? Yeah, why persecute us thou me? And so, so like, yeah, I can mm -hmm. think you did say Paul instead of Saul when you were when you were saying how oh, you did say um, Paul gets shot. I don't know. Yeah, no, nah, Paul is Saul. Saul, yeah. Saul, Saul, Saul. Name was changed from Saul into Paul by yeah. Yahweh. Yeah, your Lord changed the changes name. Yeah, oh, so yeah, can, so can, can. that is what that is what going on. So before when he was persecuting the Lord, he was known as Saul. I was his given name. But when the Lord changed him over. Change his name as well. So it is two different souls at time. Yeah. Name, Correct. Name, yeah. Name, the other soul yeah. Name. Yeah. So that's what that's what went on there. So yeah, that's Paul. All right. So let's continue in Revelation. But basically, that's that's what it, that was about. All right. Let's continue in verse two. Two. Yes. 
Revelation 1 and verse 2. Mm -hmm. It says, Who bear record of the word of Yahweh Shai and, a, no, and the a, word of power? Yeah, Salakia, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Who bear the record of the word of power and the testimony of Yahweh Shai Which we know is the spirit of prophecy. Go ahead. Can. And of all things that he saw, mm -hmm. blessed is he that read it mm -hmm. and they that hear the words of this prophecy mm -hmm. and keep those things which are written therein. For the time is at hand. Now, when you say blessed, see that you read that really mean blessed, see that understands. Because yeah. I have some Christians who read this and never understand that damn thing. Okay. Right? When I Christians come up to me already and say, Boy, I read and read and read and I can never understand. There are no oil. Right? Yeah. <laughs> well, that going into spirit. The golden oil. Right? Yeah, yeah, because <laughs> you, need, you need the wisdom and the understanding. Some um, credits that you could bring Proverbs 4 and 7. Okay. I might have good whole Isaiah 11 and 2. Okay. And they need, they need that. Um, like you could have John 14 and 26 too. Which couldn't the same thing I now say there. Okay. Which one you have first? Uh, Proverbs 4 and 7. Yeah, so, mm -hmm. so the understanding is necessary. You know, you can read the scriptures a hundred times. Mm -hmm. And if you spread now, what okay, you'll never understand and you never get it. John 14, right? 26. Okay. So you'll never get the proper understanding. Comforter. Alright, because yeah, that get, the, the only the elect gonna get the Holy Spirit. You know to understand the scriptures. Yahweh Shai said, and, he, and when he give, when he gave when he spoke in parables, the apostles asked him, "Well, why, why, Lord, why are you always talking in parables?" You know, he said, "For those who give to understand will understand; the rest will never understand." Can even three and seven? Can, but yeah, that is what precept I have here line up to come out. Yeah, can, can. let's go, let's go. Proverbs four and seven. This is the book of Proverbs four and verse seven. Can wisdom is the is the principal thing. Hmm. Therefore, get wisdom. And with all thy getting, get understanding. And why we need that? Because you know, you know, you have to have that to be able to understand the scriptures. Okay. And you have to have, you will have wisdom and understanding to be able to be saved. I see at three, three and six. Wisdom and knowledge shall be stability at your okay, times. Okay. You see? See? So let's let's bring um let's get um I see eleven and two. So okay. so you know, you know, so the knowledge of <coughs> wisdom really is knowledge of righteousness. Alright? You know, to separate yourself from, from evil, right? That's basically what we're going to. So, before when you're in the world eating pork, right, they commit an adultery, mm -hmm. right, all these wicked things, right? But when they come into the truth, now we abstain from them things. They keep the Sabbath, all right? You know, you keep the high holy days and, and so on and so forth, all right? I'll keep it going. Right. Isaiah 11 and 2. Mm -hmm. And it reads, And the spirit of Yahweh shall rest upon him. Mm -hmm. The spirit of wisdom. Right, and, and this and, go and slack yeah, can we just add because this is Yahweh Shai, they're speaking about Yahweh Shai prophecy in the Old Testament about Yahweh Shai. Right, and Yahweh Shai is our head. Right, so the body had the same characteristics. Go ahead, Ak. The spirit of wisdom mm -hmm. and understanding. Mm -hmm. The spirit of counsel and might. Mm -hmm. The spirit of knowledge and mm -hmm. Of the fear of Yahweh. Mm hmm. Perfect, beautiful. Go ahead, continue. And shall make, and shall make him of quick understanding. Understanding of what? The scriptures. And the word. The word of the Lord. This truth. Go ahead. In the fear of the of Yahweh. Mm hmm. And he shall not judge after the after the sight of his eyes. Mm hmm. Go ahead. Neither. Reprove after the <coughs> after the hearing of his ear. And he not he not gonna be like um as, as a lot of these negroes out there emotional bitches. All right, <laughs> okay. he gonna he, he gonna be he gonna judge based on the word of the Lord, whatever you let the Lord say it. You know, for some people you know the, the word of the Lord become a stumbling block. All right, because they learn lies in the world and you know they're not conforming to those lies. The word doesn't conform to those lies because the word is the truth. Right, that's what the Lord brought out in the beginning. All right, what all you taught before and all you learned before was lies. All right, you know, so reject that. That's why they say you had to come into the truth as a babe. You know, mm -hmm. as a babe. Starting, starting back from small. That is right. You know, so let's go. Um, somebody can break it. Uh, Kyle, you have John here. Yeah. John 14 and 26. Okay, this is the book of John. 14 chapter 14 and verse 26 Can. say but the comforter 
which is the Holy Spirit, mm -hmm. whom the Father will send in my name, mm -hmm. he shall teach you all things. He shall what? Teach you all things. All, he's the one who's going to teach you all things. He's the one who give you wisdom. Go ahead. Good. And bring all things to your remembrance, mm -hmm. whatsoever I have said unto you. Right. Right. So you see, and the Holy Spirit brings that wisdom, understanding. Holy Spirit, which is what? A group of angels, ministering angels. All right. Holy well, Spirit comes to you, you know, when it comes to what He's chosen, and mm. it comes through what He hears. Now, the word, the reading of the word, um, you could get that in um, Acts 8 and 31. Somebody could hold that. Acts 8 and 31, Amos 3 and 7. Can. Uh, Isaiah 30 and 20. We could bring those precepts out. Yeah? Because we have to be taught. Faith comes by hearing, and hearing by the word, so we, you know. You know, go ahead. Huh? Mm -hmm. Acts 8 and 31 mm -hmm. and it reads and he said how can I accept some man should guide me except some man should guide yeah, me how we gonna how we can um how 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 we can accept how can I accept such accept some man this is somebody this was the Ethiopian eunuch with Philip the apostle mm -hmm. alright and he said some man had a guide me go ahead Ak. and he desired Philip that he would come up and sit with him. Right, sit him why? To, to teach him. He needed a teacher. Right now, how can you go Amos 3 and 7? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because the Lord said, hey, the Lord said, surely the Lord will do nothing but reveal his, his secrets unto his servants, the prophets. Okay. Right, so when you're a prophet, a man in the Lord can really teach you this truth. No woman can teach you this truth. Alright? <laughs> No, no two third wicked ass Jake Negro in the world could teach you. No pastor, no priest. All right, but a man of the Lord, a true man of the Lord, a prophet, all right, a teacher who, who ordained, who was somebody anointed by the Holy Spirit, who, 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 who have that smearing, that unction from the Holy One. Yeah, yeah, okay. that's what the unction means. The unction means a smearing, a smearing of going to what a smearing of oil, oil right? can, anointing. Yeah, yeah. all right. Because the scripture talk about how. Yeah, and the prophets had the, the, the heavenly father names written in the forehead. That's right. And I, I speak in that. Some people watch that scripture and say, Oh God, they have a brand on them. A big brand on their forehead. Hmm. Nah, it's not that. It's this word. It's the Holy Spirit. Hmm. Right? Go ahead. Go yeah, you go ahead. We know this is the book of Amos 3 and 7. Mm -hmm. Surely, Yahweh Ba'ashem Shai will do nothing, mm -hmm. but he revealeth his secret unto his servants the prophets all right so you see the prophets is one who have the secret so therefore what the prophets say you want to have a teacher right but that when you go into isaiah 30 and 20 they say you have a, you have a voice behind you okay. saying this is the way walk you in it all right no i think that is it from that one but um yeah you can read it now isaiah 30 and 20. can okay. book of isaiah chapter 30 and verse 20. Mm -hmm. yeah it's a and though the Lord give you the bread of adversity mm -hmm. and the water of affliction, mm -hmm. yet shall not thy teachers be removed into a corner anymore. Right. But, that, but thine eye shall see thy teachers. Mm -hmm. Same way we see the, the teachers. Okay. There's nobody who come on this truth. And let's open the Bible one day and say, Oh, cool! I got a epiphany where I learned this truth. <laughs> hey, what's in this thing? I'm like, oh, cool! Yeah. So, you know, your, my Lord name was Yahweh Shai. Okay. You know, and Yahweh Shai was a so called black man. But try to figure it out myself now, boy. No. Hmm. We then we hear this word. Okay. We hear this word from somebody. Okay. We just figure this out ourselves. So okay. that there are some people well and some it's not some wicked negroes in the church. <laughs> well come and say boy, they don't care what it they, they, they don't care about the apostles and say they figure this thing out themselves. It's a lie. Hmm. The lion, the lion to you. They're looking for clout. Correct. Yeah. They're looking for that clout and the next clout. Correct. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. And, and, and believe me, they will get both. Can. They will get, can get the clout in this world. No, you get the popularity. Men like yeah, Nate. Yeah. Men like Nathaniel Seven. Right? Who come up on the Elder Apostle Taha. You know, and then, and, then, and, and has never talk about it. And talk about what he learned from Elder Apostle Taha. Because mm -hmm. he was in Elder Apostle Taha's camp. Mm -hmm. Right? Bishop Nate. Yes. Can I remember that they really used to talk before? Yeah, and Apostle yeah, Gabar yeah. was an and, a, yeah. and them was an Apostle Rakar was an elder Apostle Taha camp. Hmm. And they learned from the man and after now he playing he's a big high for Lutan thing. And you're not really taking I mean to shift from the topic, yeah? Yeah. But 
and it's really taking how them IOIC men and them is, is just especially the, the high ones like Bishop Mate and them, them is one to be having no a set of cool and, and purple, and purple yeah. is royalty they come like they just yeah. signifying that they don't collect the riches here the benefits they, yeah mm -hmm. so them don't take the gift and thing really, can 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 so yeah you, you, well they can have this wool as the elder Kazakh yeah Allah say from Mississippi or they can have this wool we don't want this world. We want the kingdom. Can. We want the, or they can dress in all the purple and all the gold now. We love our purple and our gold in the kingdom. Can. Uh, we go wear our purple and our gold yeah. in the kingdom. Yeah. <laughs> and we, we have, have no. more gold and thing than them. Yeah, right. <laughs> and the purple could be richer. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. Richer is purple. <laughs> yeah. Why to hell with that boy? We don't want this world. Mm -hmm. Hell with that. You understand? Where you reach there? I, I finished it off. Yeah, can. Let, let, let me just read a quick precept, Jeremiah 3 and 15. It says, I will give you pastors according to my heart, okay. my mind, which shall feed you with knowledge and understanding. And, that, and this is what it is. So when you, when you come into this truth, you know, you, 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 you draw from the, you wean from the, you wean from the breast, you draw, draw from the milk, okay. uh, according to Isaiah 28. Okay. Right? And you know, when a man had to feed you, who, um, somebody can bring out Romans 10 and verse 14. Romans 10 and 14. You see? So you can't come and say you figure this thing out, that's not like Even people who, us who have truth, truth from other camps and eventually you know the Lord bring it to 100% truth in GMS You know? Yeah? Alright, there's um... Oh I guess some shit, I guess some of that There's um... Romans 10 and 14 mm -hmm. And it reads How then shall they call on him in whom you know what acts like I read from verse 13. Right. Romans 10 and 13. For whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord Yahweh Shai shall be saved. Mm -hmm. How then shall they call on him in whom they have not believed? How much people call on the name of Yahweh Shai in his will? Alright, that it alone go tell you. Okay. Very few. Okay. Only a few of the camps call the name of Yahweh Shai. Right? Very few. So you, so you understand now we had to be taught. Go ahead. Huh? And how shall they believe in him of whom they have not heard? Right. And how shall they and how shall they hear without a preacher? How gonna how are they gonna how are you gonna hear without a preacher? Hmm. Without a teacher, you see? So your scriptures, your first scriptures outline everything. They tell you plainly that you know you need to be taught this truth. And the Holy, how even when you're taught, the Holy Spirit is what then comes upon you and reveal it for you. And then the Holy Spirit begins to work with you, and then you could be able to break down scriptures as well. You know, that's how it works. So lucky. Mm -hmm. well, even even if it is, um, how we see in it here. Mm -hmm. um, if you look, if you look, if you look at it as. When you was going to school before, mm -hmm. you never went, you never walked in the school and you started teaching teacher. Right. You, know, you have to, right. you have to be taught. Mm -hmm. You know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Correct. So, Correct. Yeah. Before, you before you teach, you have to be taught. So mm -hmm. while you're doing this truth, when you come in this truth, you hear the word, right? You sit with you, you study to show yourself approved. And the scripture say, "Our work, man, need to be ashamed rightfully by any word of truth." And after you study enough and you build up yourself, you yourself have to become a teacher. So mm -hmm. as you say, I, 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 you know, walking just so and say one day, by brighter than you, I can tell you what to do, and I, then that come, come, come that what causes that really is pride, okay. a lot of pride. Okay. You see, just okay. right. mm -hmm. post that's okay. Mm -hmm. okay. because when you're really taking the situation with Esau too, they just show you in the in the movies and things sometimes mm -hmm. that the, the the little child has tried to edify the the teacher. You know, being like a little smart ass in the, mm -hmm. in the thing and embarrassing the teacher and whatever mm -hmm. it is. Mm -hmm. And they will set it up in this way to make it look like the, the, the child so well studied, right? And the teacher, you know, the teacher just they trying to hold his composure or hold his composure because, I mean, it's a little child so they can't get on no type of way now, mm -hmm. you know? And the child go react however it is, you know, and the other students go start to laugh and all them kind of madness. So disrespecting the teacher. Okay. But King, King David didn't disrespect King Saul. <laughs> all right? And he knew he was going to be king. He never do that. He never disrespected King Saul. Treat him because he was his elder. He okay. showed him respect, you know, and honor. And the Lord do eating after. Hmm. But even though King Saul was trying to kill him, 
on many occasions and running them down and kind of thing, you know. Mm. So that is show you know that is the way of Esau Edom. That is not the way we supposed to be. Mm. See? Right, let's go back to um, the book of Revelation. I believe we reached the fourth chapter, the fourth verse. Yeah. Okay. Going back into Revelation chapter one and verse four. Can. You see, John to the seven churches which are in Asia, mm -hmm. grace be unto you and peace from him which is and which was and which is to come mm -hmm. and from the seven spirits which are before his throne and them seven churches that are, are, are the churches that Asia Minor and they are dressed in different um, chapters in the scriptures okay. right um, and basically you know when, you, when we continue when the revolution break down we won't go, go into that you know that you know these churches are different faults now the Lord was telling them to correct it okay. alright you know they are, they are living in the, in, 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 in the among them now Sin and you know certain wrong things that they was doing, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, you go ahead. Go on. I think we finished. We finished here. So, yeah? We finished verse four, yeah. Mm -hmm. Verse right. five. Yeah. Yeah, please stop Um. Yeah. Um. No, we can't. Let me see. Read verse five, and then we we'll go into it. Go on. See, and from Yahweh Shia Mashiach, who is the faithful witness, and the first begotten of the dead, mm -hmm. and the prince of the kings of the earth. Right. So he's the first begotten of the dead, Yahweh Shai, Right. Yahweh Shai is the first. Right. It's the, and the prince of the kings of the earth mm -hmm. unto him that loved us and washed us from our sins in his own blood. Yeah, Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai is the first, so that's why he had to go through what he went through. You know, you know, before us. Um when you when you read the book of John one and one, right, you talk about Yahweh Shai being the, being the first one of creation. Yahweh Shai was the only one who was created by the Heavenly Father himself. Uh, Yahweh himself created Yahweh Shai. Mm -hmm. After he created Yahweh Shai. Everything else was created by Yahweh Shai. Right? Everything else was created by Yahweh Shai. Somebody could bring John 1 and 1. Yeah, bring it out. Mm -hmm. Sorry. No, with you. Mm -hmm. John 1 and 1. Yeah. Crap, is that you good old Colossians 1 15 to 19. Colossians 1 15 to 19. You go ahead. John 1 and 1. And mm -hmm. it reads, mm -hmm. In the beginning was the word. Was the word. Was, mm -hmm. was the word. Mm -hmm. right. and, right. the, and the word was with. Power. Mm -hmm. And the word was power. The word was a power. The word was Yahweh Shai. Okay. So the word was with the Heavenly Father, Yahweh. Yahweh Shai was with Yahweh. And Yahweh Shai was a power of God. Mm -hmm. Right? Go ahead. The same was in the beginning with power. Right? Genesis 1 and 1. Right? Mm -hmm. Go ahead. All things were made by him. Right? So all things were made by Yahweh Shai. Go ahead. And without him was not anything made. That was made. Yeah, so what you see them people going off and, and don't want to give Yahweh Shai worship and praise. Then you know for sure them they're not of his. Mm. Alright, go ahead. Verse 4. Mm -hmm. in, it, in him was life. Mm -hmm. And and the life was the light of men. And it, that goes into the laws, the laws and everything, the wisdom. Wisdom was with Yahweh Shai. Right, because when the scripture says the Lord, the law of the Lord, it leads to life. Mm -hmm. Right, when we go into the scripture, I think it's Sirach 23 20, or that have other precepts too. Right, the law, the law of the Lord, the wisdom and knowledge and understanding that we read about in Deuteronomy 4 chapter mm -hmm. that was to set us above the other nations. Mm -hmm. Right, was to lead to, to immortality eventually. Mm -hmm. Well, so that would be the, um, the, the strength or something like that in sight of all the nations. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That wisdom, mm -hmm. knowledge and understanding. Correct. Correct. Now let's go, let's jump from there now and go to Colossians 1 and 15. Okay. This is the book of Colossians 1 and verse 15. Who is the image of the invisible? Who who is the image of the invisible power? Hmm. Okay. The firstborn of every creature. Hmm. So yeah, wish I look just like the father. Go ahead. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 16. First born of every creature. <laughs> First born of creation, right? Man. Yeah. Verse 16. For by him were all things created. All things. Go ahead. That are in heaven and that are in earth. Hmm. Visible and invisible. So in other words, all the angels too. He created all the angels. Yeah. So the angels and the spirit, demons, yeah. all the spirits. He created all the demons, hmm. all the angels on the right hand side, hmm. all the spirits, all the principalities, the powers. 
So these people so dotish, and these people go and wanna worship and 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 and, and, and do wick, witchcraft and, and invoke demons. You, you all them demons do have the power of your hour shy. <laughs> they underneath him. Good. He's the king. Good. Is that what you heard this? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he's the king. So he <laughs> spirit talk. He yes. Good, yeah. Your was the father's spirit and your shy created them Good. for the father. Done. So you would go, you bypassing your hawa and your hawa shine and go to save a demon, go and save a spirit. <laughs> that's, that's a tell you. Gone, hey. that's a shame, yeah. <laughs> because, like I, like I said last right. time, hmm. right? Hmm. Now, we can't fathom hmm. how powerful the Mosa is, mm -mm. right? We can't even fathom how powerful your hawa is. Shai is, right? Yeah. And that, that is what I was going to say because the, the fact that we can't fathom hmm. how powerful the Mosa is, mm -hmm. right? And your hawa shy being the second most powerful being in the whole universe mm. in everything, mm. right? Mm. As you say, them go and try to bypass it to go and serve a, a spirit. Yeah, so that, <laughs> that you make no sense. No sense. That spirit. That what script? You say what? Who's here? Four and six. Can my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. Hmm. Because the reason why they will hmm. look to bypass him and go and serve the demons is because they're more easier to access to. Mm -hmm. Well, right. hmm. well, boy. Yeah, we go even there. deeper than that, you know. Can yeah. because <laughs> it's like you see, hmm. right? They, hmm. But I, I time to bring all the scripture. Where yeah, it is go even deeper than that because they they can't access him. You know why? Because he, he, he his level, the level that level that you yeah, are on, you need the Holy Spirit to access him. Yeah. And they yeah. do have the Holy Spirit. Yeah, they do have the Holy Spirit. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. so there is first John two one twenty. It mm -hmm. says, But ye have an unction from the Holy One mm -hmm. and ye have and ye know all things. What's that unction? Can that is the oil. Right. The unction is the, the smearing of oil, right? Can the understanding. Yeah. Because it's like oxy. Right, they, mm -hmm. they, you can repeat what you say, what you say, um, mm. they, 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 they can't um, access him or yeah, something like that. Can, yeah, they can't yeah, access him mm. because the Lord mm. never put the Holy Spirit on them to access can, him, mm, they just mm, have mm, to have demons on mm, them, mm, 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 mm. so, so they're so, running what they could, what, what they mm, could get. Mm, mm, so, you yeah. really understand how powerful it is, really, to be in a shoot, yeah, how, 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 how the, the gift that we get, the gift of grace that we get. Mm. To be able to access your yeah. shy, mm -hmm. to have the faith to be able to believe in him, to access him. But mm -hmm. in order to come to him, you have to believe in him. Mm -hmm. And then, then when you ask him of him, he will give you. Mm -hmm. But them can't even do that. Mm -hmm. Because the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit, the Comforter, which which was to come to reveal all things, which is scripture you read out before. Mm -hmm. They they, mm -hmm. they can never get it. Mm -hmm. That is why I just pray all the time. I say I just I just always thank you, Lord. I always start off with my prayer, mm -hmm. thanking the Lord, mm -hmm. right? For the mercies, the blessings, the curses, hmm. the chastisement, hmm. the, the, the mood. Well, yeah, I say mercies already, but you know, especially for this truth, the wisdom, yeah. knowledge, and understanding. For everything. Because God. everything that he did is yeah. what led me to this truth. Hmm. You know? So it's to, to, to pray now to ask him to, to keep you in this truth until the end. God. Because oh, yeah. that really endurance. scary thing. Endurance. Endurance. Yeah. The race is not for the swiftest, but for mm. those who endure. Mm. We have to endure to the end. That's how you're going to be saved. People talk about. All these Pentecostal and people talk, oh yeah, when you baptize, you go down in the water, man. Come <laughs> back up, you're saved. You're saved. You're saved no, you're not saved at all, you jackass. You're saved. <laughs> you're saved when you when 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 you when you endure to the end and you how I take you up in a chariot. Can. Or if you die in in your house, I mash you in a right righteous and a righteous state. That's the only way again to save in this thing. Right? You know? Other than that, you know, you're fooling yourself. Mm -hmm. Right? So we pray for endurance. We pray to your call on to the end. You know? Mm -hmm. Endure unto the end. Can. You know, yeah. Go ahead, Aku. You are more, yeah. You are more now. Yeah, more, yeah. yeah. Like, um, in sixteen. Mm -hmm. For by him were all things created mm -hmm. that are in heaven hmm. and that are in earth, visible and invisible, hmm. whether they be thrones or dominions hmm. or um, or principalities mm -hmm. or powers. Yeah, because even when you're in work, your boss, your boss being controlled by your your shy. Can he being controlled by your shy? I was some of them sometimes when they talk to, as they say in Romans 13, you know, the powers that be be of the Lord, because the Lord is the Lord guiding you through them and all. Mm -hmm. And if you're spiritual enough to see it, you might see it. You know. Um, it's serious. Something like that actually happened to me yesterday. You see, yeah, <laughs> that is just yeah. because the same, the same wicked um, hmm. Jake also know about my manager. Mm -hmm. Right, she was up in she emotions and thing. Mm -hmm. Right, mm -hmm. but that was she tell me right because hmm. 
Yeah. You know, I tell all the others move the trucks on them whenever it is, you know, like if you drive on a day or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. Right? And all they always saying that he's saying, I love to drive and thing. Mm -hmm. So she did walk in the door and she started watching me and thing just so, just so. Mm -hmm. So I watch and she like, what is your problem? Mm -hmm. So she started thinking now, she's like, um, I started knew what them trucks and them, you're gonna get in trouble, thing, thing, thing. So in my head now, I watch it spiritually. At first, I get vexed, eh? mm -hmm. but then I was like, I watch it spiritually because I tell myself, because I also pray to the Lord that, you know, I will only do it like if it's necessary or if they ask me. Right. Not just jump in and, and you just know, do it, yeah, do thing, yeah. Because that could lead to problems too, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you know. So I say, I will use. You know the the, the wisdom the yeah, yeah. The wisdom that mm -hmm. the, you know the Lord gave me yeah. through she, even yes. though she wicked. Yeah, even though they wicked. It, yeah, because the Lord does show yeah. that she yeah. wicked. Yeah, um, to yeah. Thirds, he does anybody. Correct, because yeah. you know even Lord say, "Hey, spirit, we pull out upon all flesh, Can. and they will dream, dream, and prophesy." He does too, yeah. dreaming dreams and and seeing yeah. visions too. Yeah. Yeah. So the same way too, he could speak to you through a two third. Yeah, mm. he could speak into if you're spiritual enough to yeah. understand, you yeah. will mm. appreciate it. You can't, you can't be, be a carnal man and say, ah, he's a two third boy. I ain't yeah. not. <laughs> hey, no. A lot of be spiritual at all times. Be spiritual at all yeah. times. A lot of yeah. brothers, even in shoot, will struggle with that same thing because they yes. will tell themselves yeah. that are two thirds to them and them, they can't teach, teach them nothing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. but, 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 it's, hey, not, it's not a matter, they can't the, teach the Holy, you. The Lord is showing you something. The Lord is talking to you through men. Can. The Lord is talking to you through men. He moves, he is the prophets. But if it, you as a man Lord in your normal walk, he could talk to you through the two thirds. Can. He could talk to you through a heathen. Mm -hmm. yeah. And you and you enough to you maybe answer your prayers through them. Can. It happened to me many times. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. And that is a wondrous thing to see them yes. shine to you. You know the Lord mm -hmm. working with you. Yes. Because yeah. sometimes they just watch you and stare at you and I kind of stare. Mm. They don't know what they're saying. Can. The angel take over their body yeah, and talk and, and answering you. Yeah. I'll say it in the angel as a messenger. Yeah. And he yeah. saw no damn thing because they show in the movies how the people again possess right. certain things. Right. So the same way here they say how was shy, what? They say how was shy is over visible and invisible. Yeah, the invisible power is using yeah. the visible power. Yeah. Yeah. Visible. Can. You see? Go ahead, Aki, continue. All right, so continue. Mm -hmm. All things were created by him mm -hmm. and, and for him. And for him. So he's going to be king. Go ahead, king, king of kings. With 17. And he is before all things. The Alpha. Go ahead. Can. And by him all things consist. Yeah, we saw powerful, right? Our was shy, yes. Go ahead. Can. With 18. And he is the head of the body, the church. The elect. Go ahead. Who is beginning the firstborn from the dead. Hmm. The same thing we read in Revelation. Can. Can. Go ahead. That in all things what? he might have yeah. the... Yeah. Preeminence. 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 Can. So he had to be first in all things because he's the head. Can. Right? So he had to be first and suffer before the rest of the body. Right? I wanted to. I'm at a precept. Yeah, one Can. Okay, let's read verse 19 and then we. I could bring it up. Can. Yeah. Right, verse 19. For it is pleased. Yeah, pleased. Fear go ahead, for it please. Before, um, we should come off. Yeah. Um, for it is pleased the yeah. Father that in Him mm -hmm. shall mm -hmm. all fillness dwell. Yeah, it pleased the Father for, for Him to be first in all things. After all, He was the first. He, first. he was the first. All right. So I just show you. Go ahead, Aki. Aki. You have a precept. You bring it out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's um, First Corinthians eleven and one, mm -hmm. and it reads, mm -hmm. "Be ye followers of me." Mm -hmm. Even as I also am of Hamashiach. Mm -hmm. Verse 2. Now I praise you, Greek brethren. brethren. Mm -hmm. Now I praise you, brethren, mm -hmm. that ye remember me in all things mm -hmm. and keep the ordinance as I delivered them to you. Yeah, the, the laws, the rules. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. The street, but I would have you know that the head of every man is a Mashiach, mm -hmm. and the head of the woman is the man, right? And the head of a Mashiach is Yahweh, Hashem Yahushai. This is which is that is the order. Can that just go so sure because <clears throat> as um, mm -hmm. 
you had that, a collection say so that that order no wanna see oh yeah, yeah. Okay, that order that order was set up from from the beginning can because um mm -hmm. you see it basically gave you a proper structure here now the part who we mainly touching on is um your how and your how shy mm -hmm. because this just showing you here like I said, the head of your hawa shai okay. is your hawa, mm -hmm. right? It had nobody else in between, so it's your hawa, your hawa shai, then man and then woman. Right, so your shai is the, is the mediator to the father. Can. Yeah, he always really was. Can. You know, he always really was. And I, that, that, taken us into, um, that also taken us into verse 6 in Revelation. Can. All right, that taken us also into verse 6, because verse 6 talk about um, uh, being, us, him making us kings and priests. Can. All right? Because we, we had we had the um the, the Levitical priestly lineage, alright, which was a temporal thing. Alright, for them being mediators for us to the Heavenly Father for our sins and whatnot. But the Shai um came came to bring something more perfect. Alright. He came for up from the tribe of Judah, alright, of which is to spoke nothing about the priest priesthood as the scriptures say. Alright, and he he perfected that, he perfected it, he perfected it be as being a mediator to the Father. Good. And for us now, for all of us now to become priests and kings. Right, of the nation of Israel. Yeah, oh, our priest is a priest going into a teacher. Can. Teacher of the law. Right? Because um, mm -hmm. in the same Colossians 1 and verse 15, we say, mm -hmm. Who is the image of the invisible power, mm -hmm. the firstborn of every creature? Right. Right? Because this are not proven it. Mm -hmm. Because even in um, John 1 and 1, as you read, right? Mm -hmm. When you read it, it, it basically say that, you know, um, Yahweh Shai was with the with was with Yahweh and mm -hmm. he was the wood, mm -hmm. right? He was the firstborn of every, of every creature, mm -hmm. right? And in the same Corinthians, First Corinthians eleven and three, mm -hmm. right? It say Yahweh, right? Well, Yahweh Shai, mm -hmm. right? He's Yahweh's son, basically. Yahweh is the head of Yahweh Shai, mm -hmm. and then man underneath because. As I said before, right? He's the second most powerful being you know, mm -hmm. in, the, in, in the whole. In, Right. Entire everything. So what right. I, that that precept really good really telling you, telling you the divine order. Can. So the divine order was set up from the beginning. Right? That order was it set up from it's it, that that is the rule of the Lord, the Heavenly Father himself laid down. Can. You see? So so it's only natural now that you know even the end it wasn't the beginning, so in the end, right? The scriptures say that the scripture also say our shah is the Alpha and the Omega. Can. So he's the beginning mm -hmm. and he's the, the end because he's gonna rule the kingdom in righteousness. Can. Now let's jump back into Revelation one and six. It's a, and he had made us kings mm -hmm. and priests. Mm -hmm. Godly sinners have spoken against him. Mm -hmm. These are mur murmurers, complainers, walking after their own lusts, and their mouth speaketh great swelling, sw swelling words, having men's persons in admiration because of advantage. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh that, that one I was saying was yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I gone back yeah, quite a bit. Yeah. Good, good, good. So like here. Yeah, six, yeah. Yeah, we're reading verse six, mm -hmm. right? It say, and had made us kings and priests unto Yahweh mm -hmm. and his father. Right. To him be glory and dominion forever and ever. Right, so the Lord is the one who came came by his dying, by by him dying, you know. You know, he defended <laughs> for, for the remission mm -hmm. of our sin. You know, he was counted woody. To not only be, be be us make us king but and but priest also you know in the, in the common rulership all right mm -hmm. and to show you that you know you know Yahweh Shai was the one to do it because um when Yahweh Shai was a tribe of Judah you know you know we Lord count him way to be priest as well the, um it had one king of it like lineage of Judah um Judah who tried that and you know I didn't work out well for him that's Uzziah um Uzziah king of Judah he he went and and um bypassed the the the, the, the priest even though he was king and try to go and make sacrifices in the temple okay. and the Lord smite him with what leprosy <laughs> right, you can get out oh, you can bring it quick we can bring the whole thing 2nd Chronicles 26 and 16 2nd Chronicles 26 and 16 alright because you know that's a show that it was your wish that was your wish place it wasn't his place to be to be the first king and priest you see yeah yeah 2nd Chronicles 26 and 16 Yeah, this is just an example to illustrate, illustrate it, you know. Yeah, this is um, the book of Second Chronicles 26 and 16. Mm -hmm. But when he was strong, mm -hmm. his heart was lifted up to his destruction. And they're talking about the king because he, he did well to the Lord for in his early part. Mm -hmm. Then after all, he got prideful. This is just a warning for us to remember. All right, go ahead. Yeah. For he transgressed against Yahweh Bashem Rashai. 
his and power. His Yah power. Yahweh Bashem Shai, his power, mm -hmm. and went into the temple of Yahweh to burn incense upon um, incense upon the altar of incense. Go ahead. Verse seventeen. And as um, and Azariah, and Azariah mm -hmm. the priests went went in after him, and with him. Four score. Eighty other priests, eh? Four score. Mm -hmm. Four score. Go ahead. Four score priests of Yahweh that um, that were valiant. Th that were valiant men. Mm -hmm. Brave men. Go ahead. Yes, eighteen. Mm -hmm. And they Which and they man? withstood Josiah, mm -hmm. the king, and said unto him. It, um, it appertaineth. It appertaineth not unto thee, Josiah, mm -hmm. to burn incense unto Yahweh, hmm. but to the priests of the son of Aaron that are consecrated, that are consecrated to burn in to burn incense, go out of the sun um, of the sanctuary. Mm -hmm. For thou has trespassed. Yeah. For thou has trespassed. Yeah, yeah. He, not, he was king, he was not supposed to be a priest. Hmm. Uh, at the same time, right? I, that, that honor was for your worship alone first, and then he then to us. He hmm. had to get preeminence and everything. Go ahead. Hmm. Hmm. Neither shall it be for thine honor from Yahweh thy power. In other words, now the Lord will not honor will not honor him for this. Go ahead. Go on. 19. Then um Uzziah mm -hmm. was was wrought. Yes, he, he furious, he vexed, they come and tell him anything. He get, he get lifted up with pride. Go ahead. And had a censer in his hand to burn incense. Mm -hmm. And while he was wrought hmm. with the priests, hmm. the leprosy even rose up in his forehead. His whole forehead becomes sort of get white. white yeah. so, called, so called white, red. Hmm. No pigment. Go ahead. Before the priests in the house of Yahweh, from besides the in, from besides the incense all, altar. See, so Lord, deal with him for, for that, all right? Mm. Go ahead. I'm telling you, you know, my tongue is for this. And I, that's what that's the kind of judgment the Lord just said. Yeah. They shout, you know. Whoa. That kind of judgment the Lord don't care. Lord is not a respecter of persons. Don't care. He was a king, yes, and he was the descendant of the line of Solomon, eh? Mm. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Um, which was your, which was your shy. Shy. <laughs> But that, 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 that yeah, honor was only for him. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Go ahead. Verse 20. And was, um, or, and, and Azariah. Azariah mm -hmm. the, the, the chief, chief priest, priest mm -hmm. and all the priests look upon him, and behold, he, and behold, he was leprous in his forehead. Hmm. And they thrust him out. From thence, yeah, they tell him they rush, they rush it, they rush him out fast yeah. because he rest of his body would have get, would have get it. Good. Even when he had a piece of leprosy unclean, mm -hmm. so they, they was trying to save him really. Good. But his own pride was was his enemy. Mm -hmm. See, go ahead. Yeah, himself ha hasted. He hasted he himself. He hasted. Mm -hmm. Also to go out because the power. Smitten. Had um, had smited him because the Lord could have killed him. The Lord could have put him to death. Can. So the priest now look at him. They were kill the king. The Lord would have killed him. They rush him out, and he run out, run out now because he frightened us now. Yeah, no answer. <laughs> yeah, 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 right. Even he is, he is frightened. Yeah, and the Lord leave him as a leper till he die. Mm -hmm. I tell you, you on the spot. You on the spot. Imagine, <laughs> right? That's the power you have actually been on shy. You saw the whole time and then you saw like a puff up and you lot of you died on my hand. Mm -hmm. Oh boy, <laughs> that's not telling you. Yeah. That was real frightening. You did that to Aaron and Moses' sister too. Yeah. When she came up against Moses. Good. Still on the spot, a whole body. Hmm. Yeah. You see? So I ran for the thing. Sure yes. That is the Lord that worked for me to make sure you fear him. Yeah. Alright? So, 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 so. And a lot, a lot of times too, also to um, people like to come and say, you know, um, that Yahweh was shy, and the Mosai is one, is one entity, and that's not true. Thing, eh? Yeah, that, that is not true. Yahweh was shy is a separate entity. You know, they like to use the scriptures, and they say, um, like in First um, Corinthians one and ten, 
that they say they are one, it basically going to tell that they are one accord, right? Then, they're not the same mm -hmm. person, they're different. Right, but when it comes to the word of truth and you understand, then they are the, same. the same page, yeah? exactly. Because they say, um, yeah, mm -hmm. I say he in the, he in the likeness of his father, right? Right, mm -hmm. right. That, that proven right. that and mm -hmm. the um, the confounding that shit what they're saying. Because if you say in the likeness of his father, mm -hmm. right, which means he's his son, two separate beings, right? Yeah, right. I mean, right. just said are the same mindset, then, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. right? But there's two separate beings, right? And you also right. say something else, you say, you say, my father is greater than I. Mm -hmm. So if it's his father great and how you can be the same person, you'll be the same like your father. Right? right? That is not that's a lie. So the same way now when we speak in this word of truth now, we one with them. Right? And a, a good example we can use to show the hell the heavenly father, how shy was separate to is also that um your how shy the heavenly father favorite our favorite apostle was Peter. But yet mm -hmm. your how shy favorite apostle was John. Mm -hmm. see. Right? That don't mean that that they had different preferences in that, but they had one mind when it come to this yeah, word. Yeah, same it, belief. So that's showing same, something. Yeah. Because the same two apostles not like they're speaking no. something different. It's yeah, the same thing. It's the same. Correct. Correct. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, yeah, well, shall I say that he loved John as the apostle he had loved. Hmm. That's why John received all them revelations too. <laughs> he was yeah, favorite. That, I mean, was, <laughs> yeah. on, you're so nice. <laughs> <laughs> you know? That is it. You know, but that okay. is a normal thing with Jake too. Mm -hmm. You know? But um, you know, at the end of the day, it's the Holy Spirit. You know that 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 you must only understand, and then the scriptures and everything else is good. Holy Spirit, and let's um, where are they? Oh, oh, all right, well, yeah, yeah, let me see how far how much we can push through. Let yeah. me see how much we can push through before. Mm. Mm. Um, verse seven, seven. Okay. yeah, so Revelation 1 and 7 said, mm -hmm. Behold, he cometh with clouds, mm -hmm. and every eye shall see him, and every eye will see him. Go ahead, and they also which pierce him, and all kindreds, kindreds. Of the earth shall wail because of him. Right. Even so, amen. Right. So, so what we're not talking about, you come up with clouds. The clouds are the UFO, the so called chariots, yeah. right? I Somebody gets um, Psalm 104 and 3. Psalm 104 and 3. I think, um, yeah, Carter, so you could get that one. Second Ashes 13 and 1. Psalm 104 and 3. Let me see how quick we can move. Psalm 104 and 3. And we can do our. I mean, I'll come back and finish it up. Can. One, one of four and three. Can. Can. This is a, this is a book of Psalm 104 and 3. Mm -hmm. Who lay, um, who lay the beams of his ch chambers in the waters. Mm -hmm. Who make the clouds his chariot. Who make the clouds his chariot. Can. Right, so you see what the Lord talking about, the chariots, so-called UFOs. His flying saucers, right? Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Who walk it upon the wings of the wind? Which means if it flies, a flying vehicle, hmm. okay. right? So the so the so the Lord Himself, you know, He coming back, He coming back in a chariot. You know, the same way He went to hmm. when when He went in the when He went to the book of Acts. Um, I mad you wanna bring out that Acts six, Acts one, so lucky and verse six. Hmm. Yeah. He coming back the same way He He, he same went. Way he left. Yeah. Okay. Correct. And they Acts one and seven. Is it? <coughs> yeah, I can start from verse six. Mm -hmm. We don't do this thing. Acts 1 and 6. Mm -hmm. yeah. And it reads When they therefore will come together, they ask of him, saying, Lord, Yahweh, with, with thou at his time. At restore, this time, yeah. At this time, restore again the kingdom to Israel. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. And he said unto them, It is not of you to know the time of the seasons mm -hmm. which the Father had put in his own power. Because the scripture says that the son don't even know the time where he mm. had a, that he gotta come back to take the kingdom. Only for her father and, himself. And so that he had this, mm -hmm. this this to show you also that mm -hmm. it's two different beings. Can. Correct. Can. Correct. Well perfect. Oh, forget another yeah. example, another example, yeah. yeah. Correct. Yeah. Go ahead. But ye, this will say, mm -hmm. but ye shall receive power after the Holy Spirit mm -hmm. is come upon mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. And ye shall be witness unto me both the both in Jerusalem mm -hmm. and in all Judah. Yeah, all Judea. Judea. Mm -hmm. And and in Samaria. Right. And unto the uttermost part of the earth. The Lord say, witness unto me. 
right? But what he was, he, he was talking about, at the most part of the earth, he's talking about reincarnation, right? Because um, the apostles never came to the utmost part of the world, but they was in the eastern part of the earth, right? In the so called Middle East, right? Mm -hmm. And the utmost part of the earth then would be on the western hemisphere. When they preached that, it wasn't talking more in that time, it's talking about any reincarnation. But the same men, the same apostles came back and taught us this truth, you know? Mm. Right? So, you know, so back, you know, and that is really what going into, right? They came back, starting with the elder, elder high priest, Abba Bivens, you know, and they taught this truth in the utmost part of the Western Hemisphere here in Babylon the Great, around mm. the area here. And that is them who came back re in reincarnation, you see? So, so that is the proper understanding. So we don't we don't know we don't know the exact time the, the, the Lord coming back, but we have the signs. The scriptures talk about in the second Ezra, in nine chapter, measuring the signs. Also in Matthew 24, give us certain signs, right? Mm -hmm. You know? That is that is basically that is when you go into it. Um, um with respect to the the the, the um, when we drew back to Revelation or Revelation 1 and verse 8. And verse 8, it's all it's now verse oh, 7 verse he was seven. reading. Okay. And talking about the chariots too. You know. Back then, they didn't have any planes or helicopters and nothing like Because they say when you go up, in fact, Ark, you want to finish off reading that Acts 1, you know? Right. Yeah, you finish reading that first. Then mm -hmm. after, we'll go into that. Yeah, Acts 1, and where you reach, um, reach Yeah, let's read verse 9. Alright. Or oh, 10. Alright. Mm -hmm. This is Acts 1 and 9. Mm -hmm. And when he had spoken these things, mm -hmm. while they beheld. He was taken up, mm -hmm. and a cloud received him out of their sight. Right, and that cloud is reading in Ark reading Psalm 104. It's talking about a chariot. So a chariot received him out of sight. He was lifting up in the air. The chariot was beaming him up Thank into there. Right. So the same way he went, the same he way he's gonna come around. back. Mm -hmm. Right. Go ahead. You can read verse ten. Uh. This was ten. And while they looked steadfastly, steadfastly towards heaven. Mm -hmm. As he went up. So he was going up slowly, straight uh, up. Imagine the tractor being pulling him up and he was talking to them as he was going up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, see? Go ahead. But for, for those of you who are looking and hmm. might think there's a set of nonsense we're talking, it, yeah. Like, yeah, we'll put it this way. It's like, hmm. like if he was levitating and he get pulled up. Yes. You know? okay. Yeah. Okay. But everybody knows Star Trek. Yeah. And all them things when they tractor be my yeah. ship and they pull it into the, the, the bay. And all them things like that, you know, it's the same thing. Mm -hmm. But I think they get from, they, they've yeah. seen these chariots yeah. doing they that. Yeah. They know, these, they know, uh, they know very yeah. well, yeah. And they always seen all you know, kind of movies yeah. with um, aliens and things and people Correct. getting abducted and all yeah. that thing. Even, even um, teleportation, they know that the angels could teleport. Mm -hmm. That's what they show on them things on Star Trek. They're yeah. trying to make it to all kind of things. Yes. And for them to be able to show these things, mm -hmm. they, they get it from, from somewhere. Correct, uh, correct. And, yeah, go on. Yeah. Um, accent 10. Mm -hmm. Um, first, <laughs> Acts 1 and 10, <laughs> Acts 1 and 10, yeah. yeah. And, while, and while they looked steadfastly towards heaven, as, they went, as he went up, mm -hmm. behold, two men stood by them in white apparel. 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 Yeah. So in white clothes, like white mm -hmm. garments, as the angels. Mm -hmm. Angels, two angels stand up right there. Mm -hmm. Right? And you can read, you can read verse 11 now. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah. Which also said, Ye men of Galilee, mm -hmm. why stand ye gazing up into heaven? Mm -hmm. This same, this same Yahweh Shai, mm -hmm. which, which is taken up from you into heaven, shall come in like manner as ye have seen him go into heaven so he only coming back he went on a chariot and he coming back on a chariot okay. right and he and back then they didn't have no they didn't have no chariots and no they didn't even have no planes and no airplanes okay. right and you know you know even if they have it where they would all go as the scripture say flesh and blood can't inherit the kingdom okay. right so where, where he was gonna go he can't go into the kingdom right so that they show you it wasn't a normal thing it was a uf watch so a chariot okay. right so um we reach verse 7. Verse so for, well, we're still on verse 7, right? They say they say they which pierced him, right? So let's talk about reincarnation too, right? Mm -hmm. okay. So so um and it's reincarnation. No, re, no reincarnation, talking about um re meaning back carnation meaning what? In the flesh. Okay. So back in the flesh. When the, when these people who pierce him come back in the flesh, right? Which we know the spirit never die. Alright. 
<clears throat> we um and, and we have a we spend a certain amount of time on earth right and then we go back into the spirit realm for a certain amount of time right we actually spend more time in the spirit realm than we spend on earth because mm. we spend two to three generations okay. on in the spirit realm mm. and then we spend mm. one generation in, on the earthly realm so it's actually you mm. well, no we're not aware of it we always spend more time in the spirit realm that's why that day mm. when the spirit realm is way 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 shorter it's way way shorter mm. yeah because we had rest right um and of course, we know the righteous and the wicked, which is some of the wicked, the ones who play some more Edomites, right? The Romans, hmm. right? They, they go, in, they go also go into paradise as well too. Those hmm. devils, yeah. right? <laughs> yeah, we had in the book of Job, Job three and sixteen, <laughs> we on down. Yeah, they go, the they, they, they had rest too as well. Yeah. Like the Job talk about that, right? The wicked and the, and, the, and the righteous, you know, they go to the same place. All go to the same place. Please ask this tree. Talk about that. Yeah, because um. We say when 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 um somebody mm -hmm. dead to roughly paraphrase mm -hmm. all spirits return onto the, the one that created them. Mm -hmm. so Correct. All them going to the same place. All them go to the same place. But um you know when you when you go you don't remember it as the scripture say in Ecclesiastes one and eleven. Okay. Right, Lord, Lord say you go put it in remembrance. And do we once know this? Why how we put this remembrance through the scripture I read before? The Holy okay. Spirit. The Holy Spirit come mm -hmm. and he put in remembrance of all okay. things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? So even though we do, we you know we they, they right now, the people who pay us here, which I they still here, they here on the earth, they were born again and still they here right now, mm -hmm. right? But they don't know who they are except the time when the Lord come now, He go put them back in remembrance now and say what we was shit, we was I do that boy, I do it. Mm -hmm. like the Edomites and they know they don't know why they get any judgment. Yeah, they're waiting for judgment, right? 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 Yeah, yeah, they will know why they get they get any judgment, you know. And 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 the scripture talk about them wailing, right? They go wail why because you know at the end of the day, Esau kingdom being taken down, they the rulership. That is why how shall I come and knock? Scripture right. saying Daniel 7 and 18, the saints shall take the kingdom. Hmm. Right? So they, are, they will be very afraid. They'll be very, very afraid. Moving shaky. See? Very shaky. <laughs> yeah, very, very shaky. Continue right, like, Revelation. Yeah, you go ahead. Go on. The Revelation 1 and verse 8. Mm -hmm. It says, So am I, Salakia. Mm -hmm. I am Alpha and Omega, mm -hmm. and beginning and the ending. Yeah, we read about that, right? Go ahead. Go on. Said the Lord. Which is and which was mm -hmm. and which is to come, right. the Almighty. The Almighty, go ahead. I, hmm. John, who also am your brother and he, companion. And, he, and Lord say he is, he is the Almighty. You know why the scripture say all power and rule was given unto him by the Heavenly Father. Hmm. Okay. He is He is Almighty. Okay. All right, people understand. You see? Mm -hmm. All right, go ahead. <laughs> I remember when I did write as someone as younger saying, I, I've been blessed by the Almighty. Eh? Hmm. Hmm. The Yahweh is all is Almighty. Good. All right, go ahead. It say, I John, who also am your brother and mm -hmm. companion in tribulation, and in the kingdom and patience of Yahweh Shia Mashiach, was in the eye that is called Patmos, mm -hmm. for the word of Yahweh Bashim mm -hmm. and for the testimony of Yahweh Shia. And what's the testimony of Yahweh Shai? Hmm. We know that the testimony of Yahweh Shai. Yeah, we knew it all about him. Yes, I know it. The testimony of Yahweh Shai. The wooden. The wooden. The testimony of Yahweh Shai. I you see it. I see it earlier, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, remember? It's as you see. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You see that now? Mm. That is for me on this one. Come like when you know when they when they when they're going out tested like you know the answer, but because you're thinking so hard, they can remember. Yeah, I <laughs> I know. See now, tell Oli, right? Oli, remember this time. Testimony of Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy. The spirit of prophecy. prophecy. And that is really what the Lord was given Paul here. Um so like yeah, John. He was given John here John here the spirit of prophecy. The testimony of Yahweh Shai. You see? You see? For the testimony of Yahweh Shai, you see you see um what you see? I John also am a your brother and companion in tribulation. You see tribulation, right? You gotta go through. And in the kingdom and patience of Yahweh Shai and Mashiach was in the isle that was called Patmos for the word of the Heavenly Father as a punishment for preaching the word, right? And for the testimony of Yahweh Shai, the spirit of prophecy, because he prophesied and he said what was going on in the kingdom, the kingdom going to come to an end, all them things like that. And prophesying that we going to rule, you know, he, he, you know, he was put in change, that spirit of prophecy. You see? Yeah. Hmm. You know? Now let's jump continue. down. To, yeah, continue. Let's go down. Let's go down. Turn. <laughs> verse 10. Mm -hmm. Yeah, verse 10. It mm -hmm. says, I was in the spirit 
on the Lord's day Gone. and heard behind me a great voice. And what's the Lord's day? The day of your return? No, the Sabbath. Can. Yeah. Can, Sabbath. Can, can, yeah. Can. Right? So he was in his Sabbath, he was in Lord's day, he was in his spirit, the Holy Spirit was on him heavy. On yeah. the Lord's day, because you know when in Lord's day, what you do you meditate? Right. Yeah, 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 meditate yeah, yeah. on the prophecies, yeah, right? The scriptures, yeah. right. So you see, continue. Right. Um yeah, it's and heard behind me a great voice as of a trumpet. That's the voice of your house. Go ahead. Can. Saying, I am Alpha and Omega. Imagine how you were saying it. You know, in them movies, they said, I am the Alpha Omega. and Omega. And the Omega. Power. Real power and loud. And, and yeah, because yeah. you know, the scripture talk about how you have a voice like a multitude. Right. It's powerful. Like, he, like, um, yeah. like I know the Niagara Falls, but heavy and powerful I is. So mm. imagine you're trying to compete with the Niagara Fall, that drowned out everything. Yeah, you can't hear yourself. You can't hear yourself think. No, no, no. Go ahead. Go on. So in verse 11, it says, saying, mm. I am Alpha and Omega, the first and the last. Mm. And what thou seest, write in a book mm. and send it unto the seven churches mm -hmm. which are in Asa um, Asia, mm -hmm. unto Ephesus, mm -hmm. and say unto Samaria. Smyrna, Smyrna, yeah, mm -hmm. and unto Pergamos mm -hmm. and unto Tyre, Tyatira, Tyatira. Why don't we have all these dashes in you? And unto Sardis, oh yeah, and unto mm -hmm. Philadelphia, mm -hmm. and unto La Dosia, La Laodicea, La, La, yeah, La Dosia, yeah. And I turn to see the voice that spake with me. Hmm. And being turned, I saw seven golden candlesticks. Which going back to these seven churches that we read about earlier, right? Go ahead. And in the midst of seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, hmm. clothed with a garment down to the foot. And we know what you have, shall I go to Rev somebody bring Revelation 2 and 18? Can. Is that right on this page? Yeah. Where are you yeah, Revelation 2, that's the very next page. Very next um, oh. yeah, chapter. And it reads and unto and unto the angel of the church in Tyatira Tyatira mm -hmm. right these things say the son of power. Who is and you know because in, in Revelation oh. one it said the son of man, right? Okay. But here it's saying the son of power. Okay. So the same one who was talking to the church, right? Okay. So you know know this is your shy, right? Go ahead. The son of power mm -hmm. who had his eyes like unto a flame of fire. Right. And his feet are like fine brass. So this is what this is what we're gonna read about in Revelation one now. So we know that is your how shy they're speaking about. Mm -hmm. So we confirm, right? Mm -hmm. Um let me go back and continue in Revelation 1. Can I read verse 12? Mm -hmm. No, I don't read verse 13 still. So. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's say, and in the midst of the seven candlesticks, mm -hmm. one like unto the Son of Man, clothed mm -hmm. with a garment mm -hmm. down to the foot, mm -hmm. and good about the pups with a golden girdle. So here right there now you're seeing too that Yahweh Shai. You know, it's not even that's a spirit. The sound of like they talk about is a spirit and thing. Nah, nah. the scripture say if it, if it is any nine, that he come in the flesh is antichrist spirit, okay. right? Yahweh Shai himself say he come in the flesh when he go to Matthew twenty four and thirty six. They talk about you know when he when he came back, he tell I think it's Thomas doubting. Thomas is doubting. He say hey, look, feel yeah. me, see me, see if a spirit have flesh and um see if a spirit have bone. Hmm. Yeah, he, he, he had flesh and bone. He has a body. He came in. So I'm gonna say like he's a, yeah, he come in his spirit. You know, spirit. He came in. He came in the body. He was mm -hmm. literally in the flesh. He rose from the dead. Okay. Yeah, he rose from the dead. You see. So yeah, and he had all these scars from the way he went through. Okay. Yeah. All right. So um, let me verse see. Verse fourteen. Very rich. Was that the end of verse thirteen? Yeah. All right. Let's so check. that. So um. Let me see. I can go for you. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. In um, Revelation. Mm -hmm. In verse 14 it says, mm -hmm. his head and mm -hmm. his hairs were white like wool. Right, white like wool, right? So white in color and woolly in texture. Okay. That's what we're talking about. Go ahead. As white as snow mm -hmm. and his eyes were as a flame of fire. And that great, the grays and the white hair represent wisdom. Okay. That's why it's Elliot, when it's, the scripture saying even in the law, when a white and a hoary head man coming here, so stand up and salute him. Okay. He needs to remain seated. 
And that's one so, thing to even mm -hmm. the people remember because they say, as they grow green hair, you see how they dye your wisdom shit. And some people want to pluck it out of them. Yeah, and that's how you fool it. <laughs> Plucking out your wisdom. <laughs> you talk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You say how foolish this will is, boy. That reminds me it's of foolish, this will is, boy. You pulling out your wisdom. <laughs> right? The scripture said the wisdom on the old of the old of the, old, of the age man is says grey hair. It's grey hair, that's roughly paraphrasing. So Damn. you pulling out your own wisdom, which is your grey hair. That's how this will or you are throw and die on it. To mash up your scalp and put poison to your body. You see? Same, same Foolishness. Same like, same 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 quick. Quick. Uh, Proverbs 21 and 20. Um there, there is there is treasure to be desired and oil in the dwelling of the wise, but a foolish man spended it up. Yeah. That can, can, can yeah, foolish yeah. man, but uh, it, but the, the foolish, mm -hmm. but they don't understand. The, they, they they don't understand the um, they don't understand those things. They destroy oh. for lack of knowledge. Mm -hmm. So all I'm trying to cover it up or trying to block it out. Mm -hmm. Right, I would, <laughs> I would do it. See me always the beard represent, you know, manliness. Yeah, yeah, as a badge of male dignity, oh, yeah. a man beard. The power is so it, it was so a man beard in the ancient world was so important. Hmm. You can even come, it was a shame for you hmm. not to have no beer on your face. Hmm. A shame. No, they walk around with their face like baby buttons. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> smooth, 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 yeah. yeah. I thought some men, they thought this man named Brian too. Mm -hmm. Now I don't care if him grow a beard. Everybody who first see thinking is mm -hmm. that old granny. <laughs> oh, that, that is a real um, shame for a man if a man yeah, can't grow a curse. beard. Yeah. You look out a real curse. But King David and all his men, his mighty his men, when he went, they went out and, and they got captured from the um I think it's either the Ammonite or the Moabites to catch capture them. Mm. And when they what they do to shame them, they cut off the bottom of their garments and they shave, shave off half of their beard. Half. Mm. So when they went back now, King David when he found out what, what they do to them, King David said, now nah, they don't don't come into the city until their beard regrow. Mm. So they had to stay out in the city for a few weeks and months mm. until their beard regrow, then to enter the city. Because if today they will be shamed, yeah. and I says men, so he say now, nah, will you? Yeah. Don't yeah. do that. Don't say outside yeah, there. Don't Let that grow back, and then so I like, see how important our beard is. Mm. And our beard actually is is um a beard actually is more hygienic than having a clean shave on face. Okay. Okay. That's how funny it is. A beard is actually clean your face and stop cleaning up bacteria and from your skin and all them things like that. Okay. See that? And that's one point. Yeah, Destroyed for lack of knowledge. Just right? in work, we were talking mm -hmm. about this certain fella who um. Who has to turn real nasty buttons all over his face and thing. Mm -hmm. Real like to mark up one thing and just shave off his beard and thing. Mm -hmm. And I mean, mm -hmm. all that to do with the amount of snacks and thing he's beating, eh? Mm -hmm. But he's, he does shave off his beard and all them kind of things. Yeah, all them things. So he not only good. leave like right, right here, so. Yeah. But, <laughs> Shaving yeah, off. Yeah, yeah. Putting arrows on your face is bacteria and infection and in your yeah. skin and all them things. Yeah, those things not good. And just see how Wasa does. Was that as um hmm. lady roads on them just so the man face look good? Patchy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> bumpy and patchy. Yeah, yeah, bumpy, bumpy and patchy. You know? Yeah, yeah bumpy and patchy. Anyway. Hey, nonsense boy. So that where we reach verse 14? Verse 15. So okay, yeah. so yeah. But what is that um, the image? So I was it I went over his hair, right? Gun. Then yeah. they talk about his eyes. Gun. Right? His eyes were, were, were a flame of fire. Um somebody could get Genesis. Genesis 49 and 12. Bring your last precept. Somebody get, get Carter said you could bring that. Genesis 49 and 12. Um, um, mm -hmm. I'm mad you could bring out. I can't look old here, boy. Matthew 11 and 19. <laughs> Just don't pull out your wisdom, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I do not at all. Let's try that one. Matthew um, 11 and 19. Yeah. Genesis 49, you know? And 12. Yeah. Yeah, I prophesy of Jacob. Yeah, right? Go ahead, Ak. Cut book. Mm -hmm. Genesis 49 and verse 12. Mm -hmm. His eyes shall be red with wine. Mm -hmm. So you see, you see why his eyes red because he drank wine. Right? The scripture when I talk, what they say is, see how his eyes are wine. Biba, I can bring in that. Um, oh yeah, is that one verse you read? I can have any more nervous. No, I, right. I keep jumping, jumping over the match. You 11 and 19. Mm -hmm. No, I just had it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, yeah, mo that was asking you. Yeah, yeah, go ahead, you go ahead. Oh, oh, oh. No problem, you go ahead. Yeah. 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 All right, yeah. right. Yeah. Still, um, mm -hmm. his eyes shall be red with wine mm -hmm. and his teeth white with milk. Can his teeth white with milk? Teeth white with milk, going to represent a new wood. All right, go ahead, Ak. you bring it out. Bring all your match 11 and 19. This is uh, Matthew 11 and 19. Mm -hmm. 
the son of man mm -hmm. came eating and drinking right the lord keep eating and drinking and people say he didn't drink alcohol as a damn line mm -hmm. go ahead and they say behold a man glutton thus and and a wine, a, a wine, wine a wine, a wine bibber. Somebody used to drink a lot of wine. Yeah. <laughs> so, so you see, so, so, you see, the Lord was a glutton because he liked to eat and he liked to drink. Mm. Take a drink, you need to drink That's to excess, it. obviously, but yeah. he would take a drink. Yeah, you see, buddy. yeah, um, you understand? That normal Jake thing, that normal Jake. Go ahead, that dies attack. No, no, um, mm -hmm. and a wine bibber, mm -hmm. a friend of. Publicans mm -hmm. and sinners, but wisdom is justified of who? Children. Right, wisdom and judge. Because, because the elect will understand that they ain't gonna be, ain't gonna be no offense unto them. You know, you loyal to and, and, and meet with sinners and whatnot. Mm. You know, for the rest of them, that is saying, you know, and when we, when we talk about the, the, the teat white as milk, milk, that milk, going to the word, remember the scripture, say desire the sincere milk. Okay. Desire is, I think, First Peter two and two. Desire is sincere milk, right? In the scriptures, right? The wood, but the wood come from where? Now your mouth, okay. right? Okay. You know. So let's let's um finish what jump down now to verse fifteen. Yeah. How much again to go? How much again to go? Okay. Okay. So day verse fifteen mm -hmm. in Revelation it say, and his feet like unto fine brass. Into fine brass, you know, mm. fine brass, and people will say, yeah, yeah, brass, and then brass and bronze, and then it's two different it's thing. And bronze, mm -hmm. bronze is a light color. At the end of the day, all, all, all of them is different um, variation of derivatives of brown. brown right? When they go into that, when they go into it, you know, continue on reading. Huh? They say, as if they burned in a furnace. Well, and if it burned in a furnace, so even if it was a light brown, if something burned in the furnace, it's, it's turned black. Yeah, even if you put some white in a furnace, it, it could not turn black. <laughs> see, it's so, so foolish. Yeah, they... it's, so, it's so foolish. Yeah, yeah, was, uh, yeah. People mad out yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> when the Lord say he's blind, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, frightening thing, yeah. He's blind indeed, boy. Yeah, when you go into that wood, they talk about electron bronze, mm -hmm. and when they pull up a picture of something that's electron bronze, mm -hmm. they will see the color of it. And imagine mm -hmm. something electron burnt, which is a deep brown, mm -hmm. right? And you burn that in a furnace, mm -hmm. right? The man, he was very, very, very dark. He's a dark man, right? You know, contrary to the, the wicked Cesare Borgia image that they put up, mm -hmm. right? So all this is the revelation, you know, the image of the Lord, mm -hmm. the name of the Lord, all those things. Yeah, mm -hmm. continue. Let's see, on his voice as... The sound of many waters. Right, like how we say, we talk about the Niagara waterfall. Okay. Heavy. And the voice like a trumpet, like we read earlier. Hmm. Okay. Right, we're shaking, he was frightened. Powerful. When you hear that voice and you see that such knees start tremble and buckle. Okay. The power of Yahweh Shai in glorified state. You hmm. see? So the scripture talk about, um, um, I think it's I see Daniel 10 and 5. Somebody can bring Daniel 10, okay. um, 10 and 5. Okay. You have, oh, you, you have no, 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 yeah. no. Daniel 10, that's, just, that's the image of the Lord again. Okay. Right? That's a precept. You go into it. Okay, now it's the image of Yahweh. This one is the image of Yahweh. No, it's the image of Yahweh. Daniel 10 is the image of Yahweh. Too. Yeah, Daniel 7 and 9 is the image of Yahweh. Hmm? You hear that? Okay. Yeah. This is the book go ahead. Daniel 10 and 5. Mm -hmm. Then I lifted up my eyes mm -hmm. and looked, mm -hmm. and um, and behold, a certain man clothed, clothed in linen. In linen, Yahweh Shai. I was to go back to, and they go back to Ezekiel, the ninth chapter, right? The ink writer. What they say he was clothed in what? Linen. Linen. Go ahead. See his similarities. Mm -hmm. And linen is a high quality because it's best clothes to wear, even better than cotton. Linen and cotton is what we supposed to be wearing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because the because with that does um, they say with that. Does, um, it does interact with the frequency. Yes. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, body. Yeah, um, your body can. can. Cotton yeah. and linen interact with linen even better when it is breed. Yeah. It is breed. You know, no bacteria. It promotes healing and everything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, go ahead. I right, continue. And I say, um, whose loins were gilt. Girded. Were, were, were girded mm -hmm. with fine gold of. Of Ufaz. Ufaz. Yeah, Ufaz. I mean, he had a big golden belt. Hmm. Right? Go ahead. And the six. His body also was like the burly beryl. Of the beryl. Right, so he had on a green garment. He had on a green garment. 
right? The green going into going into the 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 the, 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 the color of Judah. And mm. when they go into the frequency too, from all the frequency, the color frequency, the 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 the, the, the healing frequency, the frequency, the main frequency of the universe is the going the color of it that, that mirrors back is green, right? Mm. You know that, that when they go into the frequency and they when they when they go back to the color scale is green. Okay. Green is life. And they try about Judah too, the the, 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 the stone is is green is green. Right? Mm -hmm. I can't remember. I think it's the emerald, if I'm not mistaken. It's okay. green, it's a green colour. Right? right? So that's the colour you always shy. So when you watch all these trees and things, mm -hmm. you know you, you the scripture, you have plenty of metaphors about mm -hmm. the um, you know, the trees and mm -hmm. all these things. The trees when it when it's alive, it's yeah. green and when it's dead, then it's you know, what? It's Korean brown, and brown yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Instead of Japanese brown. Correct, correct, yeah, correct, yeah. Right. right. When just said with even Tai Tai Wai um Tai Wai with like the chakras that are surely the different um mm -hmm. colors. Mm -hmm. yeah. hmm. Correct, correct. Because frequency and color is related. Right. Frequency, color, with frequency going into sound too as well, and the color yeah. it, it, it is related. You ever notice on those um them bass speakers and boom speakers? Some of them are lights. Mm. Yeah. Reason why because they are related. Yeah, it's yeah. related. You go ahead. Yeah. Sometimes too, you're so lucky. Yeah, you see, like when they're trying to hypnotize you, mm -hmm. different colors and things you're using. Sounds, yeah, with the frequency. Right. <laughs> I see flashing lights. We flashing. Yeah. And the frequency is going up and down and out and yeah. fluctuating. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. So this is just this 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 get your real vex with um the soul. Mm -hmm. How it is he blind all of us mm -hmm. to, to and and have us believing other things uh, believing in um G C. Mm -hmm. We don't mm -hmm. like to say that name. Mm -hmm. you know? <laughs> yeah. We okay. believe in G C and he in the background doing all his research mm -hmm. and Blind, continue blinding us by with the lights and the the different frequencies and things. Cause mm -hmm. you know about Correct. these things. Correct. Mm -hmm. You know. In fact, in fact, it was it was Rockefeller. It was Rockefeller, and them who um who 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 um gave the tuning for all musical instruments, mm -hmm. right? And if the tune that they that 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 they select when it hits, I think is a, a certain a certain note, right? Is it actually devil's it is music. devil's frequency? Okay. Yeah. And, and it's done intentionally. It, it, it actually it have no other way to hit that to, to tune it, to be to tune it. The only way you can tune it is to tune it to the, that exact way in order to hit that frequency in that note. Mm -hmm. So you know it's in, it's fully intentional that what what they was doing. This thing so deep. Yeah, yeah. it's real deep. Yeah. The damn devils. Yeah, yeah. The devils. The devils. <laughs> and all this all the wickedness devices yeah. being revealed right now. Revelation. You know. Yeah, go on, Ak. You continue reading. Continuing. Um, I might have finished what you were saying, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, can't. All right, continuing. And it's um, mm -hmm. um, his face mm -hmm. as the appearance of lightning, mm -hmm. and his eyes so, as lamps of the fire. Can't. So, so, so his face was shining. Mm -hmm. the scripture yeah. talk about that too. Uh, um, wisdom make it a man face to shine. Mm -hmm. um, um, I might you could bring out Ecclesiastes 8 and 1 quickly. Mm -hmm. Right, and Ak will finish it off. Wisdom making a man face to shine. Yeah? Ecclesiastes. Um, eight, eight and one. Yeah, eight and eight one, yeah. One. Mm -hmm. Ecclesiastes. Ecclesiasticus. Eight N and one. Nah, Ecclesiastes. Yeah, that's yeah, right. Yeah, that's right. Ecclesiastes. Yeah. And it reads, Who is, who is as the wise man and who knoweth the empathy, the in the in interpretation, interpretation. interpretation. Mm -hmm. of of a thing, a man's wisdom maketh his face to shine. Mm. Mm. And your shine is wisdom. Mm. <laughs> so and can you imagine how his face was shining? Mm. Go ahead. And the boldness mm. of his face shall be changed. Mm. So in other words too, his face must look real austere, real serious. Yeah. Real, real, real serious. If any, in other words, he's frightened to look at. Yeah. Even the image on the poster, you know, I bring out that before, you mm -hmm. know, the brothers. Well, 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 but the, but the, 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 the experience I had with my niece too. Yeah. That mm -hmm. alone too, was, she was afraid. Yeah. Real, real frightened. Can remember when I was telling yeah. everybody the co-worker in this? Yeah. Now we know, yeah, I'm sure it don't look like this, but it yeah. just goes to show. Because mm -hmm. right? the eyes, the eyes shining. 
right? And, and she, she was afraid of that. Scary. Yeah, and look, and, and you know he laughing. He yeah. even see, he even face yeah. it, and they still afraid of. So imagine. This my wallpaper. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And them watching at this and this scene is scary. She said, oh, he look like a demon. Right. See? <laughs> Allah Shadia, boy. Allah Shadia, demon like powers. <laughs> demon like powers, boy. Watch out. Yeah, look. Yeah, this is the exact scripture, too. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, this is the, is the right scripture, yourself, too. Illustrating that. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. That's, um, verse, verse 6. Yeah. Right. Um, his face as the appearance of lightning. Right. And his eyes as a lamp of fire. Which way red, red eyes. So mm -hmm. I'm just glowing like how you see, you know, we're supposed Superman eye glowing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. Glowing red. Go ahead. I want to slap that for one eye, you know, mate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hmm. His arms and his feet like in color to polished brass. What, what, what color? Polished Polish brass. brass. Polished brass. A deep, a very dark brown. Okay. Right? Go ahead. And the voice of his words like the voice of a multitude a uh, multitude like how you see hmm. all them on them movies when the demons start to talk you okay, hear different shaky. voices powerful yeah 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 yeah, Washa is powerful, our Lord. Yeah, it's a powerful Lord, boy. You know, and you know, and this is what he saw that he saw covered his face, the judges, you know. But you know, he been he been taken on right now. Okay. Right, but the voice of the Lord too. When he going to have voice of rock and voice, right? The Lord scripture just saying he goes for the, 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 the word is quick and powerful, mm -hmm. sharp and any two edged sword, and that also going to Second Thessalonians two and eight, which say that the Edomites will be consumed by the spirit of his mouth. mouth so they they being pulled down, the power of our Lord's voice represent this word, can. this word powerful in them. And we been take things we not seen any physical happening in the spiritual realm. They been taken down in the spiritual realm because really there's a bunch of demons anyway, can. right? And can. then after we learn, the Lord actually appear and is coming now. They will, they will, they will be destroyed at the, at the brightness of His coming, which is the chariots. Mm. So how was I doing the work all right, wrong, through us, right, through us? You see? Good. Um, uh, let's continue. Okay. Where are? Um, mm -hmm. Kyle, let's show them the picture there again. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> now, now that hmm. is that is not how we actually look, but hmm. our our power is a he have a he have a a, a, a image, you know. That you had a fear, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And Esau gave us an image that everybody had a love, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. That, that, that mm -hmm. okay. rainbow okay. person. Right, <laughs> right. Rainbow right. People, okay. Um, okay. Nice. That look now. Yeah, it's, you know? Yeah. You, 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 you will look at a picture like that and you will fear that. You know, okay. you will. It welcome in. You know? Bring out, bring out, um, that is why I just always say that to us because I always see how you could watch Jesus, right? And feel intimidating, right? Because mm -hmm. the scriptures say, right, the fear of the Lord is beginning of wisdom. You don't mm -hmm. fear Jesus. Right. So, in other words, when you fear He, you're not going to do anything according to the Bible because they, they try to put that image with mm -hmm. the Bible. Right. Right. Okay. So, when people, every time they read the scripture, they, they picture in this, this, this faggot in their head. Correct. You know? Correct. So, when they're watching He, they're thinking, mm -hmm. you know, well, He look like Allah, you will forgive me because you don't know the churches too, that's done add more more devil juice in it right which is the mm -hmm. lies the mm -hmm. philosophies they're telling yeah. me about um, oh, um god forgiving and thing mm -hmm. you can do this you can do that and pray on it and forgive you and mm -hmm. think thing and all this are rubbish that right. not making I'm no a quick precept here this is isaiah 29 and verse 13 wherefore the lord saith, for as much as these people draw near me with their mouth and with their lips to honor me but have mm -hmm. removed their heart far from me they had their mm -hmm. minds sure. their minds in the gutter the mind's dealing with says we boy she aka aka white boy jesus mm. right and their fear toward me is taught by the precepts of, of men, men. so it's not taught by the precepts in here which started to fear the lord right the lord is an austere mighty power with red glowing eyes right right and, and, a, and a, like, a face like lightning right not telling you that they tell you they show you an image of a damn freaking fairy mm. right it's something like how the lord would look yeah, yeah, yeah dread image and it, it bright. So you didn't see that's good. Yeah, but, see? But, that but, yeah, yeah, that is <laughs> yeah, face shining like lightning. Good. You see, you can't even see the face. But it's so mm -hmm. bright. 
Mm. But I would teach us, they teach us a pack of lies. So your fear now, you have no fear. Yeah, I wouldn't always say, nah, Lord, when the Lord said the fear, it means to love him. Yeah, don't worry. No, him, no, man. it don't mean that. It, it, it literally, literally be fear. afraid. Be very afraid. Well, the Lord could take, will kill you. Yeah. The Lord <laughs> will kill you. No, the Lord will take you out. Right? Lord will take you right there and try to twist the you. No. Yeah. yeah. part in the scriptures where the, um, I can't remember the names. Mm -hmm. They wanted, it. asked, they told Moses, they don't want to speak to him. Mm -hmm. They want to talk to yeah, um, can. the Lord mm -hmm. himself. Mm -hmm. Deuteronomy. Yeah. Well, well, mm -hmm. You're going to regret that, eh? Oh. Yeah. When, he, when the Lord <laughs> starts speaking to him, it's thunder and lightning. Wow. Wow. Shake out place. Oh, God. No, no, no. We don't want to talk to him again. Yeah. Moses, you, you do your talking first now. Yeah. For surely we will die. Brothers, they are going me. That is the contrast. Is the contrast? Yeah. All right. I know your yeah, apostle I mean, talk about that, these images are yeah, I've been extra pumped up that ain't thing, but okay. the point is you see you understand what we're trying to say. Okay, yeah. Right? <laughs> because that's the kind of wimp. Exactly Peter in the bush and saying the Lord is yeah. not no wimp. Oh, Skip just say Lord is a austere yeah. man, boy. And that is the and that is the thing about him yeah. because they go watch they go watch this 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 hmm. this wimpy little person and say hmm. in the in the in the deep in the spirit and the mind too. Mm -hmm. They're telling themselves what, what Jesus could really do, like hmm. in that sense, what, what, what you could really do. That would have, they ain't literally saying it to themselves, mm -hmm, but that, mm -hmm. is, that is what they're professing, you know. Yeah. Because they, they're literally saying, um, he looking so loving and kind and thing, he ain't gonna mm -hmm. really think. Hmm. Because when you watch these Edom whites on them, them don't look scary, you know, unless mm -hmm. like <laughs> when you see it in the movies and they, mm -mm. they don't know certain way and they're really showing you the evil side. Yeah. But, yeah, you know they 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 they, they look scary. Yeah. They don't look ferocious. Yeah, they don't look ferocious like our Jake. No, they look. No. If you ever see a Joe get a Jake get real mad? Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, yeah. They do. They they they, yeah. they just get afraid. But yeah. they just get afraid. That happened to my sister. Really and truly, is it that that again illustrates the power you have to me or The fact that they keep us in, in captivity for so long. Good. That definitely has, is when you are God, a power can do that. Because we naturally stronger than by far. Yeah. When you when go through the, even the Middle Ages, the Byzantine Empire, and when we was coming up against Edomites, we used to defeat them with, with, a, with a lesser force as we went through the video we did with Priscilla and them last. Can. We used to destroy them with less less men, less much men, less men. Yeah. Hundreds of men less, you know. And them and them are this big, right? big army, and we run running Yeah, we run running through that. I'll show you. Can. Really, is the Lord, they take a power to allow them to rule for so long. Because, um. Right? One of the apostles, I believe, is um, Ariam Lab. Mm -hmm. The apostle of Ariam Lab. Mm -hmm. When um, he was talking about the spiritual power that he was going to have and thing, and mm -hmm. he was going into how in in the end time, now when we get mm -hmm. the spiritual powers, like mm -hmm. five of us going to be taking on a hundred men. Yeah, the scripture says in Leviticus too. Can. Leviticus they say five of us shall change out. She's a hundred. Yeah, that's the scripture. Put yeah. up, how much the flight? Hmm. You right. know, that's roughly paraphrasing. And that that is that going to happen. That is spiritual power. Can. Thy spiritual power. Um, uh, what is he, what is he precept that read before? Um, which one is that? Just now I read? Yeah. Um, where read, boy? Um, Isaiah 29 and 13. Yeah, Isaiah 29 and 13. Yeah, Isaiah 29 and 13. Yeah. Let me just see if I can pull it back up because... Yeah, nice. Um, I'm at her Titus 1 and 16 now. Alright, come, let me see if we can finish up this chapter here. We're done already out until half an hour in. Or one and a half in. Right, yeah, go ahead, bring it. Bring it out. Sure. We got one more in. There we go. It was just to bring thing. It was I, um, Titus. Yeah. Yeah. Let me bring it out. 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 Yeah. Let me bring it out. Titus one and sixteen, mm -hmm. and it reads, "They profess that they know power, mm -hmm. but in works mm -hmm. they they was, deny was him." Thirteen. 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 Being. Mm -hmm. Being abominable. And yes, and yes, and disobedient, mm -hmm. and unto every good work, mm -hmm. report, we, we, so that you can see what we see. We have probate, we have probate, we have probate. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Titus, Titus 1 and 16. 16. Yeah. They profess that they know power, mm -hmm. but in works they deny him. Mm -hmm. Being abominable, right? It's not kind of pork and so shrimp and all kind of different things, right? Go ahead. Being abominable and the disobedient, sleeping with one another, husband and wife and all them things like that, right? Go ahead, man and a man, wife. Go ahead. And unto good work, and unto every good work, 
and unto every good work reprobate 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 reprobate, reprobate. they do they do any wickedness can go the scripture talk about how the foot swifter run and do evil and yeah, yeah, yeah 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 it's only how it's only wickedness so in other words all these things when you do all the reason why you do all these things why it's because you don't fear the lord mm. if you really fear you are me or shine no he's a he's a god but put you to death mm -hmm. like you're not you're not you are guarantee you're not gonna do that okay. you're not gonna be doing them things now let's jump back in and finish this thing off okay. let's um Revelation 1 16. and 16. Yeah, go ahead. See, and he had in his right hand seven stars, mm -hmm. and out of his mouth went a sharp two edged sword. Right, we're just talking about the word the scripture saying Hebrews 4 and 12, right? Okay. Hebrews 4 and Somebody bring it quick there. Hebrews 4 and 12. Yeah, the word of the Lord is quick and powerful, sharp, and any two edged sword. See that? Mm. Is See the book that? of Hebrews 4 and 12. Mm -hmm. It says, For the word of Yahweh is quick and powerful mm -hmm. and sharp, and any two edged sword, mm -hmm. piercing even to the to the dividing, dividing as asunder, mm -hmm. to the dividing asunder of soul of and soul spirit, and, spirit mm -hmm. and of the joints and marrow, right. and is a discerner of the thoughts and intents of the heart. So cutting, yeah, yes, it cutting both your body and your spirit. Okay. That is how powerful the word of the Lord is, mashing you up, hmm. right? And as you have a shy mouth. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, See, when? Right. That is good to show, eh? Yeah, correct. Okay. When? Well, it's just go so, back in there. Yeah, Revelations 1 and 16 see. Mm -hmm. And he had in his right hand seven stars, and out of his mouth went a sharp two edged sword, mm -hmm. and his see countenance mm -hmm. was as the sun shineth in the shineth in his strength. Which couldn't tell what? We, we, we now went and said, You he make him Lord, he, he wisdom making him your, your, your face to shine, right? Go ahead. All right, go ahead. Um, verse 17 it say, And when I saw him, I fell at his feet as dead. You see, because I see might and the power coming mm. off him. And like he felt like he was dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were just talking about before. God, he, he's so powerful. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Right, say, continue. And he laid his right hand upon me, saying unto me, Fear not, I am the first and the last. And Yahweh Shai is the first and the last. Can. Right? That's one of his many titles. Hmm. You, have, you have wonderful counselor, the Prince of Peace. Right? Those are titles, but his name is Yahweh Shai. Yah meaning he, Yahweh Shai meaning deliverer or savior. That's mm. his name. Mm. And the elect will call on his name. Scripture says that. Right? You can't be saved if you don't know that name. Mm. Right? And the Lord come to do what? He come to deliver his people. Matthew 1 and 21. Go ahead. Mm. Let's read. Verse 18, it mm. says, I am he that liveth and was dead. And behold, I am alive forevermore. Mm -hmm. Amen. And have the keys of hell. And of death. The Lord is one who can lift you up and put you down. Right, go ahead. Okay. Write the things which thou hast seen, and the things which are, and the things which are which shall be hereafter. Prophecy. Go ahead. The mystery of the seven stars, which thou sawest in my right hand, mm -hmm. and the seven golden candlesticks. Mm -hmm. The seven stars are are the angels mm -hmm. of the seven churches. Right. And the seven candlesticks. Which thou sawest on the seven churches. Right, so you see now break it down. Right, so with that, the previous lesson was edifying. I'm gonna give all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Basham, Yahweh Shai, Basham, Raka, Kodash. Double honors unto the apostles and the elders of the great millstone for teaching us this truth. Right. Peace and salutations unto the hopeful elect. Right, you know. You know, I wanna say a bad but ball destruction unto Babylon. May you be, may, may all the wickedness be revealed. All right. Continue to be revealed. Cont and continue to be revealed, you know, and push, and we will be pushed quickly to take it on. All right. Until the next time, shalom. 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 Shalom.